Now the next thing you do right after Bubble Goop is we need to go activate the next painting. So that way we can, or the next Jigsaw puzzle, sure, whatever you want to call it. So anyways, next thing we want to do is go over this way. Alright, now here's the next painting. It is for Freeze Easy Peak. Because it's frozen. You couldn't tell. Now before we leave, there's another thing we have to do. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Now I actually need to transform back into an alligator and come back here. There's a few things that we need to do before we go to Freeze Easy Peak. Alright, back to being an alligator. Unfortunately, there's not an easy way back into Mumbo's skull other than just getting out of it with that one method. So, and then we're going to come back into another to turn into an alligator again. We'll do that. So lots of alligator action, action, action. That's fine. All right, alligator time. <laughs> Luckily, we don't need to come back to an alligator since once we get far enough away from the level, it'll just transform us back. Oh, so close. But right now we do have to exit the level and go back where we were at the Freeze Easy Peak entrance in order to um, get this secret thing.
something will happen. Alright, so let's go back. So we will head on to Treasure Trove Cove before the next level. But first, I'm going to keep going upwards to see what we got. And so I can get that secret jiggy from the witch's hat up there in this area. Or actually, I guess the area right out over here. Um, before we do that, just so I don't forget and whatnot. But we're going to Treasure Trove Cove after. Alright, back to Banjo. And so we can go through the note door. Got the jig. Just as I said I would. So now we're at half of the jiggies for the witch's lair. Brunty's lair. Alright, now let's keep going. Oh, you just poop at these, get rid of them. Alright, into the next note door first. Alright. Oh. You don't want to do that. That's what you don't want to do. That's okay, I'll just stay closer to the wall. We're gonna go ahead and open up Gobi's Valley. Just while we're here, make it open. So, as soon as we're done with, as soon as we're done with Breeze Easy Peak, we can just go straight into there, and that'll be fine. And now we're gonna go ahead and open this. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Um, and there's one more thing I want to open up before we go ahead and type in the blue eggs code. Let's activate this one. That there he is. All right, so these two cauldrons are linked. Now I can go ahead and use this one to travel back there, which is why I went up this way. This is pretty close to Treasure Trove Cove. Got some stuff done. Might save me a little bit of time. It's still up this way, but it's back here. Down here. Push this is down there. Alright, 
All right, back into the cove, the treasure trove cove. Right, crab. Now, obviously, I don't need to get anything. I've already 100% of this level. I just need to get into this sand castle. Quite a bit more eggs, especially since I was low-ish begin with. And that's everything I need to do. So now we will head on over to Freeze Easy Peak. Peak. But before I go in, let's see. I don't remember if there's anything up here before I play the level, but let's take a look. Alright, well, those I don't need to worry about right now. Combo token's nice. Anything else? Nope. Okay. So freeze easy peak. 